Hey, Sexy almost drove it over the last round. That was close. I saw it. It automatically puts the mine marker down when you drop it. Thank you, sir. You can turn around. Greetings and welcome. This is Scouted Out, and I'm Proactive Death. So similar to an earlier video on my channel, Malak Mayhem, this video is more of a single round narrative, focusing on teamwork, communications, a bit of tactics, along with kill highlights just to keep it interesting. So here we are on Yohorovka, AAS version 2, and as the title implies, I'm using the scout kit. So you'll need to remember that I planted this mine later on in the video, and that I'm recording more and more scout footage. Oh, Proactive got a bunch of jeeps full of guys, make sure you tell them not to drive over the mine. Yeah, I usually, I usually stand on them if there's friendly vehicles. Yeah. So, on to the action. You guys over. Contacts. He went right over top of me. Still early on in the round, we are making a four-man assault on an enemy position. During this advance, Wix is firing 40mm red smoke grenades to mark enemies along with HE grenades to provide suppression as we move forward. Cal, watch your 10 o'clock. Got on a fat in front of me. <clears throat> we take rounds and immediately try and gain fire superiority. Frag out. Ah. Obviously, that's not my grenade. So what I didn't realize is that by putting down an IED earlier, pressing 3 would default to the cell phone. But when I do get my frag out, it's a good toss. And in squad, we don't make mistakes, just happy little accidents. Still went in there, wait. Getting back to that mine I planted at the beginning of the round. I meant north. When you finish I meant north. We don't smoke. I'm coming to get you. Yeah, put it on. No. What the? Oh. <laughs> you were in the truck like, hey. when I put it there. <laughs> I know, and I was like, hey, I remember there's a mine here, so I opened my map and go, oh, there it is. Boom. <laughs> Hey, you found it. The oh no before it was just excellent. <laughs> right behind you, bro. Rod. As you can see from my latest attempt at a map overlay, we're attacking village from the north with a suspected fob inside. I got one moving in front of me. And they might have a radio right over here. He's off to our right. Alright, Wix, attacker, can you support this bow and find that spawn point? Contact out of our fault. Another one, same direction. Off the white building directly due south. Down, close contact. Now that we are inside the village, we press in on the fob. Attacker and Dispo around the south. We're engaging infantry and destroying around the south. Yeah, uh... Yeah, pro, watch, watch uh, your hard road. You're walking along that street. Copy. I hear a vehicle. I saw a heavy moving east. Friendly. Friendly vehicle. Are you good to the east now? Or the west, I mean? Uh, negative, we've got three or four dead. 
As I step out into the street and peek the corner, you can see the sandbags piled up, which is the entrance to their hab. Hey, striker, shoot these guys right here. Yellow building. I continued to fight from this room for about two and a half minutes, but condensed it down for ease of viewing. This marks the beginning of a seven kill streak as I make a push for the hab. Well, they've been busy little bees in there. I see him. Yep. That was one of us. Yep, that was the uh, guy that we're running with over here. This is Rocket. That was my Rocket. Oh, okay, you're Rocket then. Good job. So I'm by myself on the east side of the hab and decided to go in and take a look. Now, frankly, the SKS isn't designed for this sort of work, being semi automatic and only having 10 rounds per stripper clip. But I try and make do. Damn it, I'm sorry. Here's where things start to get interesting, as I begin to get an indication of exactly how many guys are in there. After that frag grenade goes off, let's count these smoke grenades. There's one, and two. Soon to come, three. Don't make a fool me, where's four? There it is. And for good measure, an RPG comes flying over my head. So I know there's at least four guys in there, and uh, I take that rock as my chance to sneak on up and take a look. On reload. One D two. We no. I hear bandaging and decide to go for it. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Ran out of ammo. Use that rally. Get a different angle. Cause somebody's pushing down right from the fob. We finally capped village and are on our way to Northeast Petrifka. Do you want us to reload the Lodgy or just use it as transportation? Just bring transportation Contact there Contact Psycho, north. Well, that guy's a stealthy run. Frag out. I make a good toss here and get the two Russian infantry, but unfortunately I can't save Psycho. Yeah, man, we're moving, uh, we're moving the red bar. Wrapping up, we now have the Russians pushed all the way to Northeast Petrifka. He's moving to, uh, he's down, he's down, uh, he's down. Thank you, squad five. Squad five. The guy just got revived, 112. Hudson Infantry at your one o'clock. But that's it for Scouted Out. So if you enjoyed this video and other content on my channel, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It took me 15 videos, but I finally said it. Thanks for watching.